We're standing on the grounds of the home of uh, Sister Lucia, one of the visionaries of Fatima, and we're standing in front of a well where the children used to play sometimes, and the second apparition of the angel took place here in uh, 1916. The angel appeared to the children and said to them that uh, they should pray and offer sacrifices because the hearts of Jesus and Mary have designs of mercy on them. What does that mean, designs of mercy? Well, I think it simply means that God has a plan for each one of us in our life, but he wants us to follow that plan so that the graces and the mercies that God has prepared for us as we live out our vocation can be communicated to us and we can be open to receive those graces. Because we can say, well, I don't want to do this or I don't want to do that. God gives us all free will. We can get married, we can remain single, we can become a priest or religious. These are the vocations that we might be called to. But God has a plan from the beginning for each one of us. So he has special plans for us, special mercy, special graces uh, prepared for us. And if we are open to it and open our hearts, God is very happy because now his plan can be fulfilled and he can share his graces and mercy with us. I remember in the life of St. Faustina once, he said that some religious communities will pass out of existence because they are no longer fulfilling the plan that he had for them from the beginning. God gives a charism or a special gift to a, a religious founder to have a religious community do something. And if the members of the community obstinately refuse to do what God has wanted that community to do, God has no use for that community and it'll pass out of existence. So how important for all of us to open our hearts to God's plan to surrender to God's plan rather than insisting that I'm going to call the shots in my own life, but to let God's will, as Mary said, I am the handmaid of the Lord. Let it be done unto me according to your word. And then God's designs of mercy can be shared with us. And